Now that you have already created the autoresponders and the squeeze page, I'm going to teach you some more important skills that you need to know um, to generate even more income, which is how to nurture your leads and turn them into customer. Okay. So there are a few email that I going to teach you on how you can draft the email to put them into the autoresponder. So the first email, whenever someone subscribe to your list is that you should introduce yourself and uh, say thanks to subscribing. Second email, give them a big benefit of subscribing. So maybe after one day or two days, you send them a free ebook or send them another informative uh, video, which is available from most of the Clipbank uh, products uh, affiliates also. And uh, email three, share with them a customer success story. A lot of Clipbank products has testimonials and customer success stories, so just make reference from there. And the fourth email, give them informational content regarding the affiliate product. Um, this fourth e email is not selling, but it's really telling them and educating them about information on the products that you are promoting. For example, if you're promoting a product that can reduce high blood pressure, so you can uh, tell them, inform them what are some of the food that they can eat or avoid to, so that they can um, have a lower blood pressure. Email number five, give them another benefit of using the product that you're promoting. Email number six, you can officially sell them on the affiliate product that you you are focusing. For example, it's a lower blood pressure, so you can tell them that currently if they buy, uh, what's the price, what offer, what bonus will they get. Email seven is to remind them of this offer. And you can see that it's a seven email series that you can use to build up relationship with your leads. And you're using this autoresponder series. And you can educate your email list three times before sharing with them another product. So you can continue email number eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. And what I normally do is I have about 15 to 30 emails follow up for any products that I'm promoting. So you can repeat this process as many times as you want. So right now I'm going to give you an additional few email tips that you need to uh, bear in mind to have a higher conversion rate. So first, focus on the subscriber. So every subscriber who subscribe to your list, they are expecting something. So make sure that you give them that something, information or whatever things that you have promised. Okay, never over promise your uh, subscribers. And second, create attention grabbing subject line. Most of the email left unopened. So you need to uh, think and make reference from the affiliate resources on how to create a good subject line so that more people will open email from you. And make it personal. If you have captured their first name, always include their first name in the email as well. And make your email easy to read. Um, do not copy the whole long article into the email, but make it into bullet points or short paragraphs so that people can read it easily. And call to action, very important. You need to have a call to action so that people will be able to know what are you trying to tell them to do. If it's a click to your offer, just tell them that click here to find out more or click here to enjoy this special promotion now. Okay.